What's up guys, here's Claudio from Visual Motor WordPress Teams and in today's video you're gonna learn how to use in a practical way the all-in-one SEO free WordPress plugin in order to optimize your blog post for SEO and to hang higher on search engine search at such as Google or Bain for example, okay? So imagine that you already have installed the plugin, you have set it up, it's really really simple, there is a setup wizard that they want to know more about your site, your social media, your niche, your blog style or website style and after this you're gonna be into this page and what to do next after this page, it's what you're gonna be doing into this video. But before I can continue, please. Take a moment to hit the subscribe button, like this video and share this content with a friend of yours who have no idea how much it help us because you bring daily videos about WordPress, SEO, plugins, optimizations and many many more topics not just internet on the site's favor. So let's get this started. The very first thing to do is navigate to the post or to the page that you would like to optimize. In my case it's gonna be one of my blog posts, okay? So it is gonna be my new, my new post example, this post right here. And the plugin gonna automatically, as soon as you activate it, even into the free version, so no need to purchase premium, gonna do a review on our blog posts and give a tips, valuable tips, on what to do in order to optimize the post. So all I have to do is, besides the post content, you're gonna be able to see the all-in-one SEO settings, okay? But here is the first and one of my most important recommendations finish the post content okay so imagine that you have written your post let me just copy this to have a good content okay imagine that you just have finished writing your post here is just an example okay so you finish it writing your post the post looks like this and now we're gonna be optimizing this for a search engine, okay? So scroll it down and start reviewing the recommendations, okay? Let's scroll it down. And right here we have page analysis, okay? And what is this? First of all, we need to give to this plugin a focus keyword, okay? So focus key phrase. What is this? It's the word that you imagine that person's gonna use, gonna type on Google, for example, to find your post. So, in my case, it can be post example, maybe, okay? So, if you are writing about a bird, if you're writing about the car, you can, you can use the car name or the bird name, for example. So, post example, it's my focus keywords. And after the focus keywords added, the plugin gonna start working, and in my case, they find four errors, okay? Can you see right here? The basic SEO, there is four errors. And what is that? One, meta description light. The meta description is over 160 characters, okay? So, what to do? Let's review the meta description. Meta description we can enter with a manual meta description. So copy, let me remove this part and type manually. Can you see the word counter right here? 187. Of course, this is just an example, okay? So you can use the real words, you can use your key phrases. So for example, if your key phrase is a Tesla model name, for example, a car, if you're writing about a car, the key phrase must be present into the meta description, okay? After this, let's scroll down, meta description light, issue is now fixed. We have three issues to fix. Content light, this is far below the recommended of words, so the content is low, okay? We have a low number of words into our content, so we may need to write more, write a bit more, so let me try to add more content to this post. Let's check if this fixes the issue. Content light, we still have this issue, so we're gonna need to apply more content to this post. Let's try out. As you can see, the content light issue is now fixed. Good job. Now internal links. What is internal links? It's links 
to our website, okay? So a post linking to another post of our site or another page of our site. Imagine that I'm gonna be linking my homepage into this part right here. So select the text and use the Ctrl C to copy the link and Ctrl V or Command V to place the link right here. Let's check if this fixes the issue. So internal links issue fixed. And what are external links? External links are links to external sources of information. For example, if we are talking about our borderless WordPress plugin to this post, I'm gonna be linking the borderless WordPress plugin features, okay? So right here, I'm gonna be linking. We can also select the text and click into this this link right here in order to, uh, to add your link, okay? Let's review. So all the issues is fixed. All the basic SEO issues is already fixed. Now we have a title issue. What is this issue? Title, SEO, title light. The title is too short. So let's apply a bigger title. Here is the title structure. We can just remove this in the case that you prefer, okay? And enter your title. So, can you see the word counter? So we have 60 over 60. Let's review. The title is now set as good. And we have an extra tab right here called readability. Let's explore. Transition words, we have no transition words. So what are transition words? For example, so, in addition, moreover. So let's try. Moreover. Let me apply another one. In addition. Let's review. So it's getting better. If you click in this little eye, you're gonna be able to see the transition words highlighted, okay? Let's try another one. Firstly, secondly, those are all transition words, of course. You need to fit the words into your content, make it meaningful okay but once it's just an example i'm adding to show you the results so as you can see we are getting better and better okay we still have some errors right here for example image video and content you are not using <coughs> rich media like images or videos so they are recommending us to use the image let's apply a featured image to this post Let's set a featured image, maybe this one. Let's see if this fixes the problem. Nah, no problem fix it. Why? Because the image isn't into the content, okay? So we need to apply the image into the content, not only into the featured image. So find another image that relates to our content. We're gonna click into this plus button. Entering the image, maybe this one. Let's explore now. And the image is now fixed, okay? So we have only two issues, the transition words and the fresh reading essay. Easy, okay? So, as you can see, we have made a basic SEO optimization for our post in a very simple and fast way. Of course, it's uh, almost a part of art on work, okay? So you need to do this in all your posts, but not very mechanical. You need to look like a human to make it useful both for search engines and both for your readers, okay? And it is. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question. Don't forget to check out our Burles plugin to gain widgets, elements, templates and tools to build up your site using Elementor or Gutenberg for free or Enzu WordPress team, the best free WordPress team that you can install to customize your site in the way that you want or Growth.net platform, a place where you can promote your blog for receiving and publishing guest posts all for free 
our sites.gallery, a place where you can promote your site, okay? You can submit your site, your app, your mobile design, your mobile game, your game, okay? And we're gonna promote it for free. And in the case that you want to go premium, go to visualmoto.com, purchase the Visual Moto Pass and unlock full access to our entire template library with hundreds of pre-built app sites that you can import with a single click. In addition with your premium blocks, assets, templates, tools, plugins and many many more features. And it is, hope you guys enjoyed this video and I see you tomorrow. All the best!